everyone, my name is Emily Gaston. If you don't know me, I am the EOSRM technician. Um, I normally set up labs for you in the classrooms, but due to COVID-19, I am, you know, behind the scenes at my home. So if you're get, receiving this safety training, that means you might be doing some field activities um, out in the field with your EOSRM professor. So I just want to go over some basic ground rules of how to be safe while working out in the field by yourself. Work. So personal safety and equipment. When you are going on the field by yourself, say you're assigned a lab to do out the beach or something, select a safe site for lab activities. Um, no, no, uh, just select a safe site. I think that's very common sense. Uh, use a work area to prep your labs. So if you have items that you need to bring out in the field with you, make sure that you know what you're bringing and that you are able to carry it on your back. Um, sometimes you'll forget to bring things, so just prep your labs before you leave. While doing solo field work, which most of you will be doing, um, make sure you notify somebody of where you're going when you're leaving and your expected time to arrive home. That is a really big one. So we don't want you going out in the field and then never coming back due to, I don't, hopefully that never ever happens, but you should always tell somebody where you're going. You can even text your professors and say, hey, I'm going to this field site. Um, my expected time to arrive home is this time. And it's just good safety protocol to make sure that someone always knows where you are just in case an accident does happen. Um, when you're out in the field, the number one risk is dehydration. So please make sure you drink plenty of water before you go out in the field and bring water when you're in the field. If you're just going on a field trip, this is just good common practice. So always have a snack as well. Bring a snack, bring some water, always wear the correct field gear and have like hat and sun protection because the number one risk is being dehydrated. Um, another big thing that seems very common sense is look up your weather conditions. Um, sometimes you never know, it might just start thunderstorming or hailing or doing something. So make sure you know where you're going, look up your weather conditions and plan accordingly. And I always say this, proper field gear should always be worn while working on the field. So make sure you're wearing good shoes, avoid slip trips and falls, um, a cover-up's always nice, sunscreen. And yeah, if you're allergic to anything, please make sure you notify your professor, make sure that they know um, if you have any injuries or allergies as well. For COVID-19, all students need to wear a mask while out in public. So if you're out doing something by yourself or you're out in a field trip with your class, make sure that you bring a mask um, is requirement for all students. And then this is just a reminder, if you don't feel comfortable with doing a lab due to COVID, please talk to your professor for a solution. They're here to help you. Um, so just talk to them and I'm sure they can help figure out something for you. This is my contact information. Um, I'm ho I will have open office hours every Friday from 9 to 12 if you need help with labs. This is more for classes with kits if you need help implementing your lab at home. There's my Zoom room. Email me or text me. I have many modes of communication. And then this is my shameless plug for ESRM. Um, follow us on Instagram at ESRM underscore CI underscore 20. I post some pretty fun things and I like to keep up with what you guys are doing. If you're an ESR major and ESR minor, make sure you're enrolled in the ESRM community page on Canvas. Here you'll get all the faculty updates about the program. We post great job opportunities. We post club opportunities. It has resources like resume help. Um, there's many, many things in there, so please check it out. And then also, I do our jobs board, which is www.ops.esrm.zone. So it's password protected, passwords esrm.zone. So please um, check that out. I post there frequently and I post volunteer opportunities, internship, full time jobs, grad applications, scholarships. So check it out. And if you have any questions, I'm Emily and I am here virtually. So thanks again. <laughs>